Hey everybody, today we're doing a little Halloween charcuterie for spooky season. To start, we're gonna go with a couple of happy little wheels of brie. We're gonna add some of these gorgeous little manchego slices. We're gonna kind of place them in throughout the tray, spread them out, give yourself some room to play. You can make different fun shapes with these. You can kind of go in different, give yourself little sections to play with. Let's start with prosciutto. You can make little rosettes with these. You can slice it up, place them right in here. Fill up the board however you want. You can play with this a million different ways. We're gonna use some nice cheeses today, some like a little bit fancier meats, uh, a little bit more traditional um, charcuterie options. Um, but again, you can always use whatever you want. Charcuterie has become so popular, you can kind of make it whatever it is that you want to make it. Here we have a little hard salami. This hard salami you can put in a little uh, arrangement this way. You can put these however you'd like, arrange on the board, whatever you're comfortable with. Uh, salami pairs well with any of these. So we've got um, a soft cheese here, pretty brie. Let that come to room temperature makes it easier to spread um, with the manchego this is a little bit uh, more of a, a nuttier saltier cheese so you want to put that next to something else if you don't want to put it next to prosciutto because prosciutto is too salty get over it it's a cured meat board I think you go with it wherever you want you can start adding all of your accoutrement your jellies and your fruits and all that kind of fun stuff this is perfect to snack on um, well, you know, y'all are watching some scary movies. So this is a goat cheese, so I don't touch it. I left it in the little wrapper, but these already come wrapped at AGB. So you literally just take it out, smear it on the board, however you want. I like this one. Um, this chev, um, is whipped, so it's really nice and soft. I like to put a little, uh, blackberry jam over it, around it. It gives it some really pretty color. We're gonna put in here, we're gonna leave some holes. I leave the olives um, in little bowls. We're gonna add some more fruit here. We're gonna put some little berries on this side. Fill in any little dark spots or any empty spots with color here. Let's give them some guts. I did an assortment of crackers um, because I want to try a bunch of different things. I made some little bats out of flour tortillas. You can make these out of bread. I fried little baby bats and you can kind of place these in here um, just for a little bit of, you know, extra added little Halloween fun. Put these all over the board. Make sure you give yourself um, tiny little forks, tiny little cheese knives, little spoons for these guys if you don't want to touch, but you know how it goes and everybody ends up with a knife and, and you end up digging in anyway. But here we go, Halloween shark board. Have a spooky season, guys.